Hello, and welcome back to Chris the Butcher and Friends. And tonight, my brothers and sisters, we are doing something different. I have rooted out my cannon. I've got my microphone connected. I have got a memory card and I've got a charger for the battery. So this is not a special episode. I'm not doing anything spectacular, right? This is just a test to see how well my cannon is still working and all the equipment is still working and see if I can still edit it the same. So we're having some chicken in a curry with some brown rice. So there is our chicken. There's quite a bit of it, right? But there is quite a lot of us. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to season it now. I'm going to season it on one side because I don't really want to be touching this chicken again until I put it in the pan. Because then I will be washing my hands and seasoning the other side when it is in the pan. But we've got some crap black pepper. I hate these things. I can't seem to use the other ones though. They tend to, tend to break on me all the time. Might because I've got the touch of a baby elephant. Right? <laughs> And all we're going to go in there now is a raft of, you know what, we fucking love garlic in this house. Right, let's get our cast iron, cast iron pan with some oil, screaming up, I'm going to get that chicken. Let's get it seared. Right, what do you say? We get this chicken in before I boil the oil, right? I don't want to overcrowd this pan. Because it will take the heat out. But hey, I'm using the tongs because I don't want to get chicken all over me, sir. And do you know what, brothers and sisters? I'm going to have to do this in a couple of batches because it's not, I ain't got enough room in the pan. I'm going to risk death here now. The third degree burns. By seasoning the other way. Hey, hey! I think I've got the oil a bit too hot there, don't you? More we long garlic in this house. Oh, uh, crab black pepper, baby. Yeah. Ah. Ah, fucking that'll do. Right, I'm going to give that a few minutes. Let that skin get nice and crispy. And I'm going to give it a good old flip. Right, let's go for a turn, eh? Looking not looking bad, is it? Whoop. Oh, look at that skin. Yes. Nice and crispy. Right. We'll see that other side. And then get the other bits in. But you don't need to see that. So, you'll be seeing something else when we come back. I don't know what it'll be yet, but we'll find out together. All the chicken has been seared off. But before we go on any further, right, I'm going to put some nicely chunked onions in there. Yeah. We just want to get these a bit translucent, if you, you know what I mean. I've said that millions of times. If you watched my channel before, you know, half you know what I'm going to say before I fucking say it. Oh, yeah. So, that has got all the juices, all the flavour of all the chicken in that pan. So, the onions are going in there. I ain't got anything else. Really. I've, I've, do you know what? This video is unprepared. I've done this at the last minute. I've just whipped it co up, right? And this is what I'm going to be putting with it. Can you see it? Co op tikka masala curry sauce. I've got two of them, they were 85 pH. And I've got some microwavable brown rice. You know, I told you this is basically, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to call this just our tea episode, right? Because it is essentially, this is just our tea. But I want to try out the, uh, the old cannon again and see where we're going. I don't want to talk too much anyway because the video will end up about, um, about a year long. Right, we're nearly ready to put our chicken back in there. Just want to give that a couple of more minutes and uh, I'll be back with you. Right, that will do for that. Now we're going to go in with our curry sauce. 
Now, <laughs> this is proving to be a bit more difficult than I thought. Now, I've got one. I am going to do the magic trick with that. So, yeah. We'll get a bit of water in these, get the lids on them, and uh, put the rest in there. But you don't need to see that. I will tighten this up, and I'll be back with you as soon as. Well, I cleaned out the jars. Might have used a bit too much water, but I'm going to let that simmer there now for... Do you know what? I've got it on number four, which is a medium to high heat. So I need to let that water... You see the residue of water here? I want to let that bubble out, reduce a little bit, and when by the time that's done, this chicken will be done. I mean, it'll only take two minutes at microwave for rice, won't it? Hey, jobs are good and tea is nearly served. So, my brothers and sisters, this abortion is nearly ready. All I need to do now is get the rice in the microwave, get it on the plate, and then you'll see it all dished up. And that is just our tea. Chicken tikka masala with brown rice. Well, there is my finished product. Now, I don't, but just a tea, I don't normally do a taste test. But I'm going to give that five minutes or so, and I'm going to treat you. I'm going to slide that down me gizzard. And I'm going to test this on her. Because this wasn't just our tea. This is me checking out the cannon. And I'm, I, like I said, I'm unsure about the, the sound on this. Uh, when I played it back, it sounds really tinny. So we'll find out. I've got some rice. I've got some that chicken. That's what we're here for, isn't it? That chicken in that curry sauce. 85 beef from uh, Co-op. Fuck me, it's hot. <laughs> that chicken is juicy, tender, cooked to perfection. Mmm. You know what? There's no wrong with that. So, my brothers and sisters, this was me checking out the cannon. Whether it gets uploaded or not, I don't know if the sound is that shit. It won't be. But if it turns out all right, it will be. So that was just our tea. Can't remember what episode it is, but it'll be in, it'll be in the title. Right? <laughs> I liked it. That was fantastic. And that, that cost, that was cheap as chips. I liked it. If you liked it, Press like, comment, share on all your social media, and subscribe. And become a family member of hashtag TeamCTB, where I fucking love you.